Welcome to Cooking with Syl Mac, and today we are going to make some Greek shrimp skewers. Now, let me tell you a little backstory on this. My daughter-in-law is actually from Crete, Greece, and her family still lives there in Crete. Actually, we went to go visit a while back ago, about two or three years ago, and it was fabulous. Anyway, I talked with Krissa, and she gave me this wonderful Greek recipe for shrimp. So, I thought I would share it with you guys. But you know what we gotta do first. Y'all better grab that glass of wine and let's get to grilling. <laughs> so let me first show you the shrimp that I have. They are huge. I got them at the grocery store. We have a fries here. And these are like big. Can you see how big that is? They're like prawns, but they actually are calling these uh, freshwater shrimp. So. They're a little expensive, $17.99 a pound, and you only get about anywhere from four to eight shrimp when you get them for, you know, for one pound. So I've got those. I sprinkled a little salt on those, a little kosher salt, and again, I love smoked salt. I've smoked my own salt, so just kind of season them up a little bit with a little salt. Now, let me tell you about the marinade. It's a very simple marinade, and you only want to marinate these uh, shrimp for no more than 20 to 25 minutes. So I've got some olive oil, and of course we've got Greek olive oil. Chris's family actually has a olive grove in Crete, and they ship over their olive uh, oil to us, so this is good stuff. So I've got a cup of olive oil. I used about maybe a tablespoon of oregano. So I'm gonna put like maybe, I don't know, I love garlic maybe three tablespoons of garlic. I also use the zest of two lemons. You don't wanna use the lemon juice because the lemon juice, if you marinate the, your seafood in there, um, it starts cooking it. So you don't want that to happen. And it also messes with the texture. So just the zest of two lemons. And also you wanna add a little bit of wine in there. So I'll probably put like maybe maybe half a cup of wine. You wanna whisk this together really, really well. Also with the wine, you wanna have a little on reserve. So I've got a little cup like this, this little ramekin, and because uh, we're gonna brush this at the end. Uh, Chris says that's how they traditionally cook their seafood, instead of brushing it with butter. Um, at the very, very end, just when it's about done, you wanna brush it with uh, some wine, so that's why I've got a little reserve. I'm gonna whisk up this, and I also wanna reserve a little bit of this because I wanna um, sort of uh, baste the shrimp as they're cooking. So let's go on and I'll put just a little on reserve, like so. Also, oh, I forgot. If you like a little kick, and I do, um, some crushed red pepper in there. So, of course I like my food a little spicy. I was gonna add a jalapeno, and Krista was like, uh, we don't do jalapenos. I said, okay. So, she said crushed red pepper is fine. Anyway, so now I've got my shrimp. I'm gonna go on and add them to the bowl. Mesh them around a little bit with my hands. I'm gonna go on and let this marinate now for no more than 25 minutes. Meanwhile, I do have my skewers. They have been soaking in water for the past like 45 minutes. Of course, we do that so that they won't catch fire when we put them on the grill. All right, so let's get these marinated and I'll meet you out at the grill. Okay, so I've got my shrimp all on the skewers right now. They've been marinating for about 25 minutes. Got a little pan grilling, so I'm gonna go on and spray that because I don't want them to stick. And now let's go on and put the skewers on. All right, so let's take a look. They look good, let's brush it a little bit. Flip them over. Brush a little bit more of that marinade on there. Okay, so 
Okay, so in total, I think the shrimp have been cooking for about 10 minutes. These are like uber big shrimp, so that's why the cooking time is a little bit more. But if yours is smaller, then you're gonna probably wanna cook it for like maybe four, three to four minutes each side or whatever, but you can sort of choose. Yeah. Ooh, does that look good or what? Got a wine, it's just a white Pinot Grigio. dab it on there gonna let it go for like maybe another 30 seconds meanwhile I did reserve a little bit of the marinade I reserved the marinade from the reserve marinade because you want to make sure that you don't have the marinade that the raw shrimp was in or even the marinade that you used to brush the shrimp because the shrimp weren't done yet so what I did is I poured off some of the reserve so that I can serve it with the shrimp and I'm about to pour that over that right now good do these look? So you know what it's time to do now. Serve up with a little of the marinade, pour it over. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm sure I got stuff running down my cheeks. I mean running down my chin. Wonderful garlic flavor. I can taste the smoke. All of that garlic and lemon and oregano. You have got to be kidding me. For this and all recipes, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Mmm. Where's my wine? Until next time. Cheers.